how's up y'all popping with cracking it's d about to react to this vid apparently meek mill has come out saying that he is no diddy gang and people have told me to, to watch this this video that i put up i know he has this long <laughs> you know this this long history of beef with meek mill so i, I definitely want to hear what, what jokes he got to get off about this situation but yeah i think this is wild that meek is now coming out and saying he's no diddy gang Sure, but let's watch. Hey, this guy, it might not be the worst place ever then. This is a you got this shit. You was paying for the male prostitutes. What the fuck? In here? Them niggas is giving it up for free. A little cornbread here and there. Nah, they fighting over making this bad. This is crazy, man. <laughs> I thought hey, that was Olivia Benson. Anyway, yeah. um, in other news, we get to Meek Millie. And uh, Meek Mill while being in the trenches, wanted to let the streets know that he's now claiming no Diddy gang, okay? Despite what you've seen of him in the pool. Goofy. Despite, you know, uh, um, Diddy calling him daddy. To right. It, this is so lame because it's clear that you were close to Diddy. So now that the world is against him and now that he's behind bars and people are clowning you, making fun of you for your relationship with him, now you want to, you know, be like, oh, I'm no Diddy gang. I don't fuck with him. That's so lame because, yes, you did fuck with him. And the only reason why you're turning your back on him now is because of the pressure from the public, which I find to be very cowardly, very bitch made. This is not very hood of you. For you to come across like you just hood, do you come from the street, street cold, da 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 you bend into some peer pressure from internet trolls online bro telling him he deserved it despite them going with matching outfits looking like they was about to you know right. what I mean y'all was locked in fusion Stop dance and Dragon Ball Z despite you know what I mean him performing at the party and like looking Diddy in the eye locking eyes oh apparently see all that. no matter what Diddy has done for niggas man Young Miami already claiming she got another nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. He doing the same thing, <clears throat> excuse me, that Young Miami did. And I didn't like when she did that either. And let's be clear. Sure, it's no Diddy game. <laughs> Everybody is against what, what bullshit he was on and, you know, how he terrorized people, all these cases and lawsuits against him. Like, obviously, everybody's against that. But that's not the point. We're just talking about them being fake because y'all was pro Diddy to the max until he got locked up so it's like if you claiming that this is somebody that you were close to nobody's saying you have to celebrate them in the streets and and take up for them or excuse their behavior obviously but for you to just be like oh no mm -mm, fuck them i think that's whack and that's lame I, because we have all of the information about the the case and you know everything that He's accused of, but we don't know all of the details and we don't know exactly what's true and what's not. Obviously, the situation with Cassie, we saw that with our own eyes, but there's a lot of other information out there and you really just don't know what to believe. Uh, and these are people who were close to him and claim that, you know, there was no wrongdoing that they witnessed ever. So it's like, if that's the case, then why are you against him so publicly? You feel me? I, I just think that's weird. He's claiming he's no If I was in the situation, okay. I just wouldn't say anything. He showed up in the trenches, and this is what he had to say, Chad. Yeah, y'all ready? 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 Y'all no Diddy gang meet Millie. He's like a strong crackhead. Not like He's a in real life now. Strong. Don't you disrespect him. Now, Diddy's son, who already just almost packed out Ray J for his disrespect. Yeah, niggas get packed out over this shit. <laughs> this is real life. Uh, Diddy's son, Justin Cole, he comments about saying, shaking my damn head. Okay? You know, he he's, he's like, he's not jacking that. He's not rocking with me claiming he's no Diddy gang. And um, it is the unfortunate part of this. Meek has to prepare to get the Ray J treatment, okay? Next time he sees Justin Combs, Christian Combs, and he sees Quincy Combs, he's going to have to prepare for a 1v3. He's going to have to solo, no. solo trio it. He's going to have to solo squad it. That's just the reality of it. Like, yo, you're not going to, like, yo. Now, here's the thing. 
Um, what do I think about him saying that? Man, I, I wish celebrities just wouldn't be this fake. Exactly. Me. You one of them niggas who they said was real close to him. Now, I do think the gay jokes got to me. That's why he's saying no Diddy. I think no Diddy means I'm not gay. And y'all keep saying Diddy gay. No, but they even use that phrase. It's you should know Diddy. Well, actually, I don't know if you should know Diddy's gay. Here's my thing. There's a way to clear your name without almost insinuating that nigga's guilty. And yeah, I think that's what his son is kind of like doing the shake of my head for. You're saying no Diddy when you used to be at the parties with Diddy. This you makes used you to have even fun more with Diddy. This makes you look even more guilty in my eyes. Like now I I think that you're trying too hard to distance yourself from him and to dodge these gay allegations. You used to be in those situations with Diddy. But. Why are you saying no Diddy? Oh, is it because fans is finally getting on you? Mm-hmm. Is the comments getting on you? Well, you could clear your name without throwing the nigga you used to kick it with, like, in the dumps. And, and by the way, I think that's true. Like, you know... I agree with that. Um, yeah, the rest of the culture can say no, Diddy. But Meek, I don't think you can say no, Diddy. Mm-hmm. Because... It's like, we could talk shit. Like, <laughs> you know, y'all was in the pool. You know what I mean? Flirting. There was no, oh, there was no Diddy then. It was no Diddy when, you know, you basically... You and him was just kind of exchanging pleasantries and going shopping. So, again... And it I wasn't no Diddy when them cheeks was getting like, clapped. I heard the audio. <laughs> I heard the fucking audio, okay? I heard you yelling, yelping. <laughs> it wasn't no Diddy then. No, I, I'm pretty sure that was fake. Well, I don't fucking know. I'm, I'm going to assume the audio is fake. If you don't know what I'm talking about, there was some audio that was, you know, circulating, especially in the Twitter streets of uh, Meek Mill getting his cheeks clapped. By Diddy, and it was like audio of like you know, two men. You could tell it was two men grunting and <laughs> having a great time apparently. And the voice sound just like Meek Mill, so it could have been AI. I'm not saying it was him for sure, <laughs> cause I don't know. But I ain't saying it wasn't him either. Who knows? I don't know. People say it look corny on Meek's side <clears throat> because you could denounce what people are saying that you were involved with him with, or even people saying that you're gay. Which, do y'all think Meek is gay? I, don't I really know. don't know. But anyway. I don't think so. You could do that without throwing Diddy under the bus. I think he's This lying. is kind of throwing him under the bus. No Absolutely. Diddy. Absolutely. Like, if his friends is coming out and saying no Diddy, it kind of makes him look guilty. But it also makes y'all look like, what? How could you hang out with this guy for years? Mm. And now you're acting like you learned something. Exactly. So none of this you knew before. Exactly. Actually, I don't trust that. More questions That's a great point. So you ain't because if I'm if I have a close relationship with someone I've been knowing them for years and they get accused of some wild shit I'm gonna be like oh my god and of course I'm gonna wonder is this true because obviously I don't know everything about them uh but I'm gonna keep my opinions to myself and I'm going to wait for more evidence to come out and to see how how everything plays out but I'm not going to jump online and be like oh fuck them I don't fuck with them like that and no da da da. I'm not going to do that because I, I know that I had a close relationship with them and I spent years with them. I know the person that they are and I'm not going to sit up here and talk shit about them, throw them under the bus just so I can look better in the eyes of the public. That's so lame. And obviously I'm speaking of if I was a celebrity and I had another celebrity friend. Like, I, I just feel like that's so, so lame. No, none of this. <clears throat> so it took till... November 2024 for you to say no Diddy. But when you were hanging out with him last year, you were hanging out with him the year before, the year before that, the year before that, the year before that. I think he was doing the weird shit with you. You were around him, like, barely close. I think. Anybody who was close to him was doing weird shit with him. No Diddy. But now that he's incarcerated, and the evidence or accusations, let me say, are piling up, it feels right to disassociate yourself and also, I honestly feel like Meek only said the stupid shit, right? Because he's he's doing some video with some hood mans or some shit, and he's trying to seem like, nah, 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 nah. I know what y'all niggas been saying, but nah, I ain't on that. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, hey, what's wrong with that? What do you mean, what's wrong what with that? What the fuck My is that? Nigga, what do you, what's, what's wrong with it? Explain to me. I'm, I'm lost. Chat, no way, hold on, AJ. Uh, 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 are you? You see, every time 
time AJ come on here, I feel like anytime we got a meat topic, I out. think people think he come and make the meat topic better, but it always just gets worse. All right, I'll tell you what's wrong with it. Now that you asked, you wanna you said what's wrong with it, right? Yeah, what's wrong with it? Well, why was it a no Diddy when y'all were putting on matching outfits and when he was calling you daddy? Bro, I, we accidentally wore the same shit as the nigga, bro. It wasn't planned. And they took the same pictures all hugged up. Yo, I, how was they hugged up when they took a picture? I, all right, they did. <coughs> I've seen the picture. I mean, you can't take a picture with your man's nowadays. He's just trying to. He didn't know, you know, this shit was going on. They're, no, they're hugged up like a Right, the fuck? He was close to this I man. What are you talking about? They're hugged up like a you, you should be making shit up, bro. bro that that, that little friend, friend baby in the front. There's like That's a zesty not. lean, bro. Even the, way he's zesty. Ho- even the way he's holding the cup is a little, come on. He's holding it with two fingers. Come on, bro. That's a vulnerable I, pick, bro. Stop it, act. Couple. Nigga, they take a regular picture, my nigga. That's it. Look like a couple with a baby. And, and obviously, this is a grown man. This is not a baby, but I'm just. <laughs> they're, they're saying they're a couple, so obviously, the couple has the baby, whatever. Uh-huh. So, so when he was in the pool, why didn't he oh, say God. no Diddy when, when Diddy called him daddy? Clearly he didn't hear that. Clearly he didn't hear that. All right, I'm gone. He's just talking at this point. <laughs> he he didn't hear him. He, he don't know what's going on. Fuck all that. He had a close relationship with this man, okay? They were seen at multiple parties together. They were hanging out. They were BFFs, matching outfits, hanging out all the time. So he was close to the man. What are we talking about? You know what? If you don't want to understand it, that's on you. But it's clear as day that he lame and he corny and he's just trying to you know, make himself look innocent. But like I said, I think this makes him look even more guilty. Because let's be clear, if you were that close to Diddy, you were doing some weird shit with him. So you're now trying to distance yourself from him because you don't want none of that heat. And you don't want, you know, none of the, the dirt on you, but it's on you and it's going to come out, brother. So we, we just waiting on that day because you suspicious for this. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Let me know what other videos you've been watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye!